I was a nervous wreck. I had no idea what was, uh, what was going on. It was just absolutely amazing seeing the kids all clapping and cheering and just actually walking down and calling them by name. And she does know each one by name. I mean, they were all there. I mean, the whole entire thousand kids were like outside and down the hall. Lining the way for Mrs. Bird to make her way inside the gymnasium where she would be honored over and over and over again for dedicating the last 30 years of her life to educating young minds. <laughs> Knox County and the town of Farragut declaring this day Gina Bird Day, but not before Congressman Jimmy Duncan presented her with a flag that has flown at the nation's capital. There are so many people that deserve an honor more than me. For an educator so beloved by her students, faculty, and staff, when asked if she even knew she had this type of impact on her school, absolutely not. I mean, this is. I, this is home, and it's a family. It should come as no surprise. Bird does this not because it's easy or because she'll get rich quick, but because it's in her blood. My mom was a teacher, and I know we always talk about our, our families being in education, but um, I, was, um, I was born with a neuroblastoma, which is a childhood cancer. So I grew up in the hospital for the first five to eight years of my life. You know, we have a couple of kiddos that uh, have gone through cancer here and are going through it now and, um, you know. I mean, it's overwhelming because, um, like I said, I mean, this is, this is what I love doing and, I mean, it's not a job. It is not a job. In Knoxville, Gabriella Pagan, WATE 6 on your side. But her reaction was priceless. priceless. Says it all. You know, you may have noticed when you were watching Gabriella's story there that uh, the students were wearing pink. Mm -hmm. uh, that is Bird's favorite color, and they were wearing that in her honor today. I noticed that sea of yeah. pink there. And by the way, when asked if she has any plans to retire soon, <laughs> no surprise here. She said, absolutely not. That's great. Yeah, glad we could share that story yeah. tonight. Yeah. All right, everyone.